I'm Katie Crowther with today's TMJ4. Here's today's four things to know. A Kewaskum family going through the unthinkable sends out a message to the community confirming that 15 year old Valentine, one of the five Ola brothers injured in a car crash earlier this week in Germantown, has died. Valentine's 16 year old brother was driving his siblings to soccer practice when he lost control and went off the road. That driver, along with an eight and nine year old, are out of the hospital. But 13 year old Luciano is still in critical condition at Children's Hospital. The family asking everyone to keep him in your prayers. Police in Virginia Beach trying to figure out what prompted a longtime city employee to go on a shooting rampage inside a city office building Friday. State and federal investigators combing through evidence today. The gunman killed 12 people and hurt four others. Three of them are still in the hospital with serious injuries. The gunman was shot and killed by police. He was carrying a 45 caliber handgun with a sound suppressor and several high capacity magazines. The Democratic Party of Wisconsin holding its annual state convention at Pottawatomie Hotel and Casino in Milwaukee this weekend. Some of the speakers include Governor Tony Evers, U.S. Senator Tammy Baldwin and Congresswoman Gwen Moore. Sunday, they will elect party leadership for the next two years. And don't forget, Milwaukee hosting the Democratic National Convention in July of next year. State Republicans held their state convention in Oshkosh a couple of weekends ago. In weather, it's drying and clearing out overnight with temperatures in the 40s, sunshine and 60s for Sunday, and we go on to start the work week dry and sunny. That's four things to know from today's TMJ4. I'm Katie Crowther.